first up on top of this bulletin, we are tracking the preparations for the Lok Sabha elections. While well, CNN News 18 Network released the results of its mega opinion poll featuring an extensive survey covering 518 Lok Sabha constituencies across 21 major states yesterday. Now, the word of confidence has emerged overwhelmingly in favour of Prime Minister Narendra Modi. While 59% of the respondents picked him up, his nearest rival Congress leader Rahul Gandhi was far behind him at the mark of 21%. Trinamool Congress Chairperson Mamta Banerjee and Aam Admi Party convener Arvind Kejriwal were followed by and tied with 9%. Now, the study from 12th February to 1st First of March takes into account 95% of the Lok Sabha constituencies, making it one of the largest surveys in the country. Well, CNN News 18's opinion poll results yesterday projected a clean sweep in Uttar Pradesh by BJP with record mandate. Now, BJP is projected to win 77 out of 80 seats in Uttar Pradesh. INDIA Bloc is predicted to win two seats, while BSP is likely to secure just one seat in Uttar Pradesh. Take a look at what the poll results predicted. Let's talk about Uttar Pradesh. The big single state, 80 seats. The last time around, the last time around, the NDA had 62 seats there. 62 seats the last time around. This time, 80 on 80 is the target. How much do they get on the News 18 mega opinion poll in Uttar Pradesh? What is Uttar Pradesh ke man ki baat? Ladies and gentlemen, dil tham ke baithiye, because this number will also startle you. 77 seats. 77 seats for the NDA, only two for the INDI Alliance, one goes to the BSP. The INDI Alliance ka supra saf swept away altogether. The Yogi Modi combine or the Modi Yogi combine. And add to that, we'll see if that's going to be a talking point. Pran Pratishtha of Ram Lala, the Bhavya Ram Mandir built. 77 seats to the NDA and then that surge, ladies and gentlemen, out of 242 seats, the number really, really jumps for the NDA and the BJP. Let's look at the vote share. 80 seats in Uttar Pradesh, 57% vote share. Nearly a 60% vote share for the NDA, 26% for the INDI Alliance, that is the Congress and the Samajwadi Party, 9% for the BSP, 8% others. The BJP is taking Uttar Pradesh and how? 62 last time, 77 this time, 15 more seats added. The Modi plus Yogi juggernaut rolling through Uttar Pradesh. And does this now take the BJP not just close to the 272 number, further closer to the 272 number, but does this now put it in pole position to do better than 303? This is a staggering result. This is better than what the BJP did even in 2014. 2019, as Anand said, they came down to 62 out of 80, which is still commendable. 2014, it was 71 out of 80. This time, it's 77 out of 80. Only three seats going to the opposition. Where are the gains coming from? The India Alliance and the BSP getting one seat each in the Avad region. This is Lucknow and around that area. So this could potentially be, we don't know, this could potentially be the uh, Raibareli seat, perhaps. And BSP, we don't know which this seat is. The only other seat that is going, one seat in Purvanchal, which again could be Azamgarh, which has been traditionally a Samajwadi party seat. So one seat in Purvanchal, everywhere else, everywhere else, Bundelkhand, Doab, Ruhelkhand, Western UP, where people are talking about Jat Anger and all of that, None of that seems to matter because it's a complete clean sweep as far as the BJP is concerned. Like I said, it is the BJP's best ever performance in Uttar Pradesh, even better than 2014. Rahul Shivshankar, what do you make of this? Well, uh, I don't think I'm surprised. Look at the two assembly elections that have uh, taken place and the BJP has grown strength from strength. It's gone beyond its own uh, expectations, perhaps of its own self. Uh, I think fundamentally what you have to look at is very closely the implosion of the India Alliance, the declining credibility of the satrapies really at one level in Uttar Pradesh. Uh, this was a state where the BJP was up against regional parties 
and regional parties, as we know, have bettered in straight contests, both the national parties, the BJP, as well as the Congress, in election after election. This is a massive turnaround.